Whatever your age, size or shape, it's important to take care of your breasts. So tell your doctor if you notice any of these changes. Know what is normal for you so that you notice any changes in size or shape. Know what changes to look and feel for, and then look and feel for any lumps or areas in the breast that feel different. Report any changes to your GP without delay, any changes to the skin or to the position of the nipple, such as puckering, dimpling or discharge. Please attend the routine breast screening if you are age 50 or over. It is important to take care of you and your breasts. The South Birmingham Breast Screening Unit is part of the NHS National Breast Screening Programme. We are based at the Birmingham Women's Hospital in Edgbaston. We routinely screen women aged 50 to 70 years within the South Birmingham area. Breast screening or mammography is an x-ray examination of the breasts. It can show cancers at an early stage even when they are too small for you or your doctor to feel. A mammogram only takes a few minutes and involves a tiny dose of radiation, so the risk to your health is minimal. Your visit to the unit should take no more than 20 to 30 minutes. Breast screening can help to find small changes in the breast before there are any other signs or symptoms. If changes are found at an early stage, there is an excellent chance of recovery. Around half the cancers that are found at screening are still small enough to be removed from the breast by taking only a small amount of tissue away. This means that the whole breast does not have to be removed. Breast screening saves an estimated 1,400 lives each year in this country. If you wish to contact the unit, you may do so via email using screening at uhb.nhs.uk. In the future, there may be changes to the age range which we consider it appropriate to arrange your first routine screening. This could be extended from the current 50 to 70 years age bracket to the wider 47 to 73 years age range. If you're a woman in the South Birmingham area registered with a GP, you will receive your first invitation to attend for a mammogram sometime between your 50th and 53rd birthdays. After the first appointment, you will be then invited every three years until your 70th birthday. The screening will take place either at the Birmingham Women's Hospital or at our mobile unit, which will be stationed at one of six locations in the community. If you have special needs, such as a physical or learning disability, you'll be asked to contact the breast screening office to arrange an appointment at the hospital screening unit. The unit provides better provision for a carer to accompany you if you wish, and more time can be allowed for the screening than what is possible on a mobile unit. On arrival, you'll be greeted by a female receptionist or mammography practitioner. Your personal details will be checked and you will be asked about any symptoms or history of breast disease. The procedure will then be explained to you and any questions you have will be answered. During the breast screening process you will be required to undress to the waist, so please wear appropriate practical clothing. A top and trousers is preferable to a dress for example. Each breast is placed in turn on the x-ray machine and gently but firmly compressed with a clear plate. 
The compression only lasts a few seconds and does not cause any harm to the breasts. Compression is needed to keep the breasts still and to get the clearest picture with their lowest amount of radiation possible. Some women find compression slightly uncomfortable and some feel short-lived pain. Research has shown that for most women it is less painful than having a blood test and compares with having blood pressure measured. The mammograms are read by a specialist team and the results will be sent to you and your doctor within two weeks. If the picture is not clear enough, you will be asked to return for a further mammogram. If an area of concern is seen on a mammogram, you will be invited to attend an assessment clinic for more tests to be carried out. These may include a clinical assessment, more mammograms, examination using ultrasound, or a needle biopsy test to examine a tiny amount of tissue under a microscope. If you are found to have cancer, you will be referred to a consultant surgeon to discuss the options available. This is essential before making any decisions on treatment. Many women have a choice about the type of treatment they receive, depending on the type and location of their cancer. A specialist breast care nurse will also be available to give advice and support throughout.